एवरी वन वेलकम टू रूट टू मैथमेटिक्स इन दिस वीडियो गोइंग टू सॉल्व दिस इंटरेस्टिंग क्वेश्चन सो हियर वी हैव गिवन फाइंड द वैल्यू ऑफ एक्स दैट सेटिस्फाई द गिवन इक्वेशन एक्स बाई ट्वेंटी वन प्लस एक्स बाई ट्वेंटी सेवन प्लस एक्स बाई वन सिक्सटी फाइव प्लस एक्स बाई टू हंड्रेड एटी फाइव प्लस एक्स बाई फोर थर्टी सेवन प्लस एक्स बाई सिक्स ट्वेंटी वन इक्वल्स टू हंड्रेड ओके सो हियर वी आर आज टू फाइंड द वैल्यू ऑफ दिस वेरिएबल एक्स फ्रॉम दिस गिवन इक्वेशन so before going through the solution please do subscribe my channel and click the bell icon for more such interesting video so without any delay let's just start the solution so here we have given x by 21 so x by 21 is nothing but x by 3 multiplied with 7 plus the second term is x by 77 so i can write this as 7 multiplied with 11 and third term is 165, which is nothing but 11 multiplied with 15, plus x by 285 is nothing but 15 multiplied with 19, plus x by 19 multiplied with 23, plus x by 23 multiplied with 27 equals to 100. Okay. Now in the next step, I'll take common x. So we have x multiplied with one by three multiplied with seven plus one by seven multiplied with eleven plus one by eleven multiplied with fifteen plus one by fifteen multiplied with nineteen plus one by nineteen multiplied with twenty three plus one by twenty three multiplied with twenty seven. Equals to hundred. Okay. Here I am going to apply a logic in each term. So the logic is one by a minus one by b equals to. By taking LCM, we can write a b in the denominator part and in the numerator part we have b minus a. Okay. In order to cancel this b minus a, I'll multiply one by B minus a both side of equation. So here we have one by a minus one by b equals to here we have one by b minus a multiplied with b minus a divided by a b. This two get cancelled out. So this implies this. I can write one by a b equals to nothing but one by b minus a multiplied with one by a. Minus one by b. Okay. So here one thing you can notice that that each term is in the form of a b that is one by three seven. Here also we have one by seven multiplied with eleven. So I'll write each term in the form of one by b minus a multiplied with one by a minus one by b. Okay. So this implies this we have x multiplied with one by Seven minus three multiplied with one by three minus one by seven plus one by eleven minus seven multiplied with one by seven minus one by eleven plus one by fifteen minus eleven multiplied with one by eleven minus one by fifteen plus One by nineteen minus fifteen multiplied with one by fifteen minus one by nineteen plus one by twenty-three minus nineteen multiplied with one by nineteen minus one by twenty-three plus one by twenty-seven minus twenty-three multiplied with one by twenty-three. Minus one by twenty-seven equals to hundred. Okay. Now here you can see that one by seven minus three is nothing but one by four. Similarly, eleven minus seven is nothing but one by four. Here also one by fifteen minus eleven is nothing but one by four. Okay. So this implies this. We can write x multiplied with one by four multiplied with one by three minus one by seven. Plus one by four multiplied with one by seven minus one by eleven plus 
वन बाई फोर मल्टीप्लाइड विथ वन बाई इलेवन माइनस वन बाई फिफ्टीन प्लस वन बाई फोर मल्टीप्लाइड विथ वन बाई फिफ्टीन माइनस वन बाई नाइनटीन प्लस वन बाई फोर मल्टीप्लाइड विथ वन बाई नाइनटीन माइनस वन बाई ट्वेंटी थ्री प्लस वन बाई फोर मल्टीप्लाइड विथ वन बाई ट्वेंटी थ्री माइनस वन बाई ट्वेंटी सेवन equals to hundred. This implies us now taking one by four common. We have x by four multiplied with one by three minus one by seven plus one by seven minus one by eleven plus one by eleven minus one by fifteen plus one by fifteen minus one by nineteen plus one by nineteen. Minus one by twenty three plus one by twenty three minus one by twenty seven equals to hundred. So here we have minus one by seven plus one by seven get cancel out. Similarly, this two term get cancel out. Similarly, this two term and here also minus one by nineteen plus one by nineteen minus one by twenty three plus one by twenty three get cancel out. Now we have Left out with x by four multiplied with one by three minus one by twenty seven equals to hundred. This implies is x by four. Now by taking LCM we have twenty seven in the denominator and the numerator part we have nine minus one equals to hundred. This implies is we have x by four multiplied with eight by twenty seven. So four and eight get cancel out by two equals to hundred and two and hundred get cancel out by fifty. So this implies is we are getting x equals to by cross multiplication twenty seven multiplied with fifty we have three fifty as our answer. I hope you have understood the solution thanks for watching please subscribe to my channel and click the bell icon for more such interesting videos thank you